What's up, Slimers? Coming to you live from the Bible Cave for episode 144. Guys, it's been a while since I did a vlog. There hasn't really been stadium giveaways. We sprinkled in some uh, FOCO ones here and there. But um, there hasn't really been much to talk about. It's uh, no baseball thus far up until last night where um, both sides agreed to play 60 games in 66 days. Who knows how that's going to turn out with COVID and getting sick and not getting sick. <clears throat> that being said, I want to share a special bobblehead with you guys. I just got it in from FOCO. Um, I know you guys are going to love it on the website. It was only limited to 300 and these sold out super, super fast. No other than the Day of the Dead bobblehead from the Los Angeles Dodgers. So quick story behind this one, guys. <clears throat> Talked to my guys over at FOCO, and we all know that Dodger Stadium was supposed to hold the um, host the 2020 um, All-Star Game, and <clears throat> Dodgers uh, promotional department, they put an order in for um, a bunch of bobbleheads to be sold that weekend uh, during the All-Star Game and Home Run Derby and stuff. Considering coronavirus happened, the Dodgers said, all right, we're not going to have an All-Star game anymore. So Foco took them all back. They were on their site. Some are still on there, some are not. And um, this is where you find these, um, pretty much. They were supposed to be in the team store at Dodger Stadium. But since no All-Star game, they are in the possession of Foco. And uh, probably a lot cheaper on Foco.com than... Uh, <clears throat> the team store would have been at uh, Dodger Stadium. So anyway, lo and behold, you got the uh, Day of the Dead. Um, it's kind of batting stance. A lot of people said it's been uh, looks like Mookie Betts. It does look like Mookie Betts, ready to like kind of like wind up in gear and get a ready position to hit a um, to to get in a bat at the plate. Um, but this is this theme is called the Day of the Dead in the Hollywood Hills. The backdrop has the LA logo right there. You can see the Hollywood Hills. The lights, Chavez Ravine, and it's pretty cool. You have the um, the palm trees right there. The detail is unreal. The teeth are all chiseled, hand painted. There are stickers on top of here, but overall, the face dimensions and the certain creases and the overall structure of the face is phenomenally done it's unreal you got the day of the dead bat right there i'm glad they did this instead of just like a regular baseball bat they threw some yellow and a little bit of a sticker design right there it's an added feature that foco didn't have to do but they did it um, on the back of the base you have the hollywood hills everything is raised this was only limited to 300 on foco site even the top of the helmet. How fucking sick is that? If you didn't uh, grab this one on Foco's site, they went quick. This probably went like a week and a half. And then it sold out. So this is official Day of the Dead bobblehead from Foco. It was supposed to be the Dodgers bobblehead for All-Star Weekend. But that didn't turn out too well. So I like the overall structure. I like the design. The pants... Everything just screams Day of the Dead. It's spooky. It's creepy. This would be great to display around Halloween time. Well-structured, manufactured bobblehead from Foco. All-star game right there on the top of the base. So I'm digging this one, guys. I know a lot of you guys uh, ordered uh, some of these, and you're looking forward to getting them in. You will not be disappointed. I would never steer you in the wrong direction. So if you didn't get this on FOCO, you're going to have to hit up eBay or Ohio Mole Guy and he'll charge you $175 for it. So it's almost one of those situations you snooze, you lose. I post that, you know, to use my code to head over to FOCO. You got to check their inventory. Once they're running low, they're gone. So here it is, guys. The Day of the Dead bobblehead, Los Angeles Dodgers, all-star game theme. Subscribe on my YouTube channel. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, I can't say good luck sniping those bobbleheads because we don't, I guess the first game is July 24th, July 25th. I guess keep working hard. 
um, building that uh, leverage through trades with other collectors. We'll talk soon. I'm going to get a couple more videos going this week on some other products I got in. And I uh, hope you guys are well. I hope you guys are safe. Take care.